<laughs> they shot themselves. Oh, not a single casualty. Look at all those arrows. Spawners are champs. Hello everyone, Zildjian here with another episode of Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. This time I'm going to be doing a 300, the Battle of Thermopylae. It's mostly going to be based on the 300 movie, but I'm going to try to have some... Well, not historically accurate, but make it not just the 300 Spartans. Because in the real life battle, there's more than just 300 Spartans. There's also Thebans and Thespians. Yeah. There's a whole bunch of... A whole lot of Greeks. And then they retreat... Not retreated, but like, uh... They found out that the Persians found out... <laughs> the Persians found out about the secret pass. And so the Greeks decide to retreat. And the Spartans said, we never retreat. So they cover... They stay behind while the other Greek forces retreat and regroup. And the the Thespians decide to uh, stand by the Spartans. They were just mere so uh, mere Greeks. They weren't like super soldiers like the like the Spartans were. So the, after that battle, the Spartans viewed the Thespians as like great honorable allies. Well, that's pretty cool. Well, I remember my history professor saying like the Thebans were like were basically like uh, were not trusted at all, and they end up surrendering. And while while they surrendered mid battle, and then the Persians like like continue killing them anyway. Uh, okay, I got. 10 shieldmen, 10 spearmen that will represent the Spartan spear wall with shields. I'll, later I'll try one with just spearmen, but uh, yeah, my computer can't handle that many units all at once. So for the Persian side, I'm gonna have a bunch of footmen. Wait, footmen? Yeah. Doesn't have to be too neat. I don't know why I was obsessed with the uh, Spartan side. And uh, you know what? They got some barbarians. And throw in. They had their own spears. Throw in some spears. This, this is gonna be a. This is gonna be pretty imbalanced. But let's see how the Spartans work out. Oh, why am I fighting in the winter? Okay. Not... I probably messed up the formation, but okay. <laughs> and the Spartans are, are dead. Mostly the Shieldmen are still alive. But what? What? Now it's two versus four. Oh my god, what? He's just trampling over the corpse. Oh my god, the Spartans won! Outnumbered 1.5 to 1. Two Spartans per three Persians. Okay, maybe they didn't win. One Shieldman versus two versus a Spearman and a Footman. Even though the Spartans were outnumbered by 10 guys, they still bear, they still got a close match. Let's see if they can turn this into a victory. That was quite unexpected. Okay, Persians won but barely. Interesting. Let's see what if I take out the Spearman and add in some more Barbarians. And more Footmen. Oh, let me change that. Hills. You know, they're probably... They're fighting in a mountain and stuff. The desert is probably more matching. What is that guy doing over there? Oh, look at that. Spartan is doing a lot better. I think when the Persians don't have spears, they don't do as well. Oh, 
I spoke too soon. Now it's one versus four. Maybe the spears were. The spears are not that good. Maybe I need a closer Spartan Phalanx. Well, in the end, the, the Greeks did lose anyway. Let me try a closer formation. Spartans would not be like whatever, but okay. Let's see how this works. Oh, tight phalanx is no good because the spearmen just drop out of spears and look like idiots. That was a disaster. That was a complete disaster. Maybe... Maybe the shieldman can be in it. Tight. Spearman maybe leave some room behind them and that'll be okay. <laughs> Spearman drop their spears. That was a disaster. I'm pretty sure I never had this problem before. Let's try four, four rows of five. Mass spearmen, spear phalanx. Okay, I think the shields are blocking it or something, huh? Okay, what is that guy doing? Oh, that, I think shields are not even that good. It's just the spears did it way better, I think. There's a mass block of spears, never mind. Maybe thinner line of two spears. I mean, two, two rows of spears. Of course, all this time I'm. I'm having the spires outnumbered because they're supposed to be outnumbered. They look like pikemen now with all their spears in the air. Oh, look at it. Okay, this is not going exactly how I had planned. Let's see if it's more even match. Twenty versus twenty. Do, 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 do. Oh, nope, still no good. Spearman is really bad in this game. I'm not even sure what's the point of Spearman. They they can only do okay if you have shield in front. Maybe, maybe it's the barbarian. Oh no. Okay, let's see. Line of spearmen. Why is it so annoying just to get them in a line? Stop moving, mouse. Let's try it. They didn't drop their spears. Oh, the shields go in for an initial charge and the spears sweep them up. That was actually a really good charge. Overwhelming red victory. Now let's try this again with extra, extra troops. Um. 20 versus 40, that's not gonna work out. So let's try anyway. Then go back to 20 versus 30. Let's see if the Spartans can do this. Come on, you can do it. Oh! 
look at all of those guys dying. Hmm. They actually took out quite a bit of troops. Yeah, but it's gonna be a loss. They actually did pretty well for 20 versus 40. Let's see if they can take out 30. 30 guys. Okay, we can do this. <laughs> this is the worst phalanx formation ever. This is the worst spear wall ever. It's not even connected. Oh, see, look, 20 versus 30 spires. Overwhelming victory. How come they couldn't take out 40 though? If I spread them out, they could take out 40. I have some footmen instead. Spread out. Now this is really spread out. 20 versus 40. Let's see if they can do this. Way too many barbarians over there. Oh, dude. Whoa, whoa. This pine is doing really good. Out number two to one. Okay. Two versus four. Not bad. Oh, okay. No, there's actually five versions left. Two versus five, not bad. Uh, the first try I did it was wasn't so well. Well, not bad. So really, it's just the I think it's just the shields that are really good. Experience stink in this game. Well, in the actual battle, they also had some uh, lesbians in support. They also had some helots. I mean, I don't know what they're on, but I'll just make them peasant I mean, farmers. And of course, the Persians had lots of more troops. This is gonna push my computer to its limits. Let's try it. It's not that bad. It's not that great either. Oh, oh, look at that. Let's see, I can't really tell who's winning or not. But I see a lot of, a lot of Greeks still standing. Oh, not for long. Actually, a decent amount of Greeks are still alive. What are those guys doing over there? Oh my god, you're about to drop off the cliff, aren't you? Oh, some moron fella. Oh my god, these guys are going to have to drop off. Come on, you idiots. Every single match, someone drops right off the cliff. You gotta be kidding me. I think this match was actually pretty close. Was it 40 versus 60? Okay, that was bad. Let me try again. Hills. It's a much bigger map, less likely to fall off the hills. We got the Spartans in the middle, the Thespians covering the flank, and the Messenians. I'm seeing he lots covering the left flank. Stop running around like idiots. Just fight. Fight to the death like in the in the real life in the movie. Okay, that did not work out as well as the other one. Where are they going? 
Where are these guys going? Well, another blue victory, huh? <laughs> As long as people keep on falling off. Another guy's falling off. You guys can see this, right? Oh no, he, he recovered himself. Okay, that was a disaster. Now let's remake the part where they're fighting in the shade. Remember that line, right? Our arrows will blot out the sun, and we shall fight in the shade. Okay, let's see. Archers. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's fight in the shade. <laughs> they shot themselves. Oh, not a single casualty. Look at all those arrows. The Spartans are champs. The Greeks are champs. Oh, those this archers, Persians lost. Shieldmen are powerhouses when it comes to missiles. Look at that. Complete annihilation. See, they're supposed to. Oh, this part in the movie. Yeah, they're not supposed to die. But in the end, in the end, in the end, performance bad. Let's do this. Let's see how many arrows. In the end of the movie, they got completely annihilated. Oh, yeah, this is more like a movie. Look, they're dropping like flies. Well, oh, not a single piece of, not a single casualty to friendly fire this time. Well, you can tell the result of this one. Maybe that was too many. Okay, let's try medium performance. That should be good. There should be less friendly fire this time. Oh, 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 oh. They're doing it, they're doing it. So you need like a hundred archers to take out these parties or something, seriously? How many archers was this? They're barely defeating this party. I'm not even sure if they can defeat them. Look, there's still three shield men around. Oh, two shield men around. Oh, never mind. Okay, they got it. You know, you wanna you wanna represent a lot of arrows? You have a bunch of watchers. Now this is the part where they fight in the shade. Oh. And nothing. <laughs> But that was really cool. That's that's how you fight in the shade. This, I, you know, I want to see that again. Just cover the map with watches. Okay. Let's see if this will work out. This should definitely die this time. Now this is enough arrows to cover out the sun. Oh, excuse me. Oh, how many watches can I field? That's 36 watches. Almost pressed the clear button. Oh, oh shit, what are you doing? Arrows blotting out the sun. Oh, blotting out my computer. Oh! His arrows don't even hit. Jesus. Really cool to hear all the sounds. Oh my god, they're gonna win. 
Spartans are gonna survive this massive attack. I watch our barrage. <laughs> Look at the watches, they're killing each other. Oh my god. This was a disaster. What? What's going on? Did one of them not collapse or something? Oh, this one still has his arrows. We can't fire it at anyone. This one still has all that arrows. Oh, it's completely his load. Where is it? Where's your shooting? It's your shot at the ground. Oh, look at this shooting running. This still has it. Oh, no. Okay, Spartans are invincible when it comes to watches. Hmm. I guess this was uh, <laughs> not even close to the movie. Not even close to the real life panel. Let's, let's try one more. This is gonna be the last one. Leonidas. Leonidas with his sword, he tossed his shield and his spear, all he got is a sword left. Execution style. Leonidas! Oh! That's exactly like the movie. Okay, so hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this as much as I enjoyed making it. That was my attempt at recreating the Battle of Thermopylae in 300. That was a rather crude attempt and did not go as planned at all. So drop a comment, like, subscribe. Thank you for watching. Until next time.